Uh, so at the Oak Table uh, opened up September 17, 2012. Uh, we'll be celebrating our three year anniversary uh, this coming month, actually. Um, it is, it's September now, yeah, so yeah. this month. And uh, we're excited about it, um, you know, going strong and everything. The, the concept of uh, the Oak Table is farm to table. We try and keep everything as uh, local and organic as possible. Um, local in the restaurant uh, industry is a relative term. It's uh, technically within 300 miles of your location, but we try and obviously keep it closer than that. Um, a lot of our fish comes out of Cherry Point, uh, North Carolina, or even down in Charleston, Edisto Island area. And, uh, and then all of our produce actually comes right here from Columbia, City Roots, and our other purveyors um, are very helpful with, uh, with all that fresher grown farms and heritage farms as well. Um, and uh, we just kind of like to keep it local, like to keep it fresh. Um, our clientele is uh, you know, business oriented, uh, but we also have a very nice casual lunch that you got to experience today. Um, and our brunch scene is very, very casual as well. It's uh, really, really nice. Um, the dinner is a little more on the fine dining uh, aspect of things. It is, we are considered fine dining, um, but we do have some lower tier things, uh, lower you know, item cost wise, I should say, um, that are still delicious and fantastic. Uh, our, our executive chef, Todd Woods, does a, a great job putting things together that uh, just like everyone will really like. Yeah, I hear y'all got a lot of great desserts. Oh yes, oh yes. Our dessert menu is uh, fantastic. Uh, yeah, our, our mainstays are the butterscotch bread pudding, and our deconstructed s'mores, those have been on the menu since the beginning and uh, they won't go anywhere because we would have riots if they did. Uh, but the butterscotch bread pudding is my favorite. I am a little biased though, I don't love chocolate. So. I don't either, so no, I'd, ha I'd probably have to go with you on that, man. It sounds good. So, so then you, you, you local, locally grown, uh, did I hear something about y'all grow some of your herbs out front here? We do, we try and, uh, so we have an herb garden out on our patio. Uh, the patio's, you know, gorgeous, right across the street from the state house. Uh, so, you know, you know great uh, scenery and everything, great feel. Uh, when it's a little cooler out on, on these Columbia days, you know, you can sit out on the patio. But we have our herbs out there. We grow peppers, basil, thyme, uh, mint, and spearmint. We have a little bit of uh, oregano out there as well. Um, but we try and keep everything there. The bar actually uses uh, a majority of it for our fresh cocktails. Um, yeah, it's really, really nice. The springtime is probably one of the favorite cocktails, and it's got fresh spring, uh, um, fresh thyme, sorry, in it. A little bit of spring juice, and then of course some mint leaves. It's all muddled together straight from our garden. It's really, really great. That is interesting, man. It's really nice. So then you're open Monday through Friday. Monday through Friday. No, no, no. Uh, lunch Monday through Friday from 10:30 to 2. Sorry, 11:30 to 2. Okay, so just lunch. And then. Um, and then uh, dinner from five till uh, to ten. And then, and the then brunch Sunday night. brunch is uh, from ten thirty to two. That's what the, the brunch is. And then Saturday night at uh, five to eleven. Thanks very much, speaking yeah, of Brian. Yeah, absolutely. I appreciate it. it. I hey, I had a great time here, and uh, you should come out to the table. Come out and see us. <laughs>